milestone anniversary for the University of Colorado at Colorado Springs. The university has been celebrating their 50th anniversary all year long. Our Kelsey Kennedy was at their year end celebration this evening. She's live on campus to give us a look. Kelsey. Well, founded in 1965 with just a few buildings and a few students, UCCS has now become a staple in our community with thousands of students enrolled. It's one of the fastest growing universities in Colorado. UCCS started in 1965 as a result of the efforts of Dave Packard, bringing Hewlett Packard here on the condition that the University of Colorado put a branch in Colorado Springs. What started as a small commuter campus. I went to the University of Notre Dame, but I took a summer class out here in the summer of 1971. There was very few buildings, uh, very few students. UCCS has grown to dozens of buildings and more than 11,000 students. Most of them stay in the community and they help transform the community, which is so exciting because it provides new leadership and new opportunities for so many people. The university, a big economic player in Southern Colorado, employing thousands and generating more than $450 million a year. And the expansion continues on North Nevada Avenue. Within five to six years, UCCS could have a billion dollar a year impact on Colorado Springs. Chancellor Pam Shockley Zalabak applauded for her success at the helm and Governor John Hickenlooper joined the celebration. Regent Stephen Ludwig is a 1993 UCCS grad looking forward to what the next 50 years may hold. 50 years ago, who would have imagined that we'd have 3D laser printing? I mean, it didn't exist. What's going to be in 50 years? That's really exciting. I just can't emphasize to the citizens how lucky we are to have an asset like uh, UCCS in our community. The university announced tonight they raised over $5 million over the past year to be used for scholarship money for its students. That was more than double their goal. Live on campus of UCCS in Colorado Springs, Kelsey Kennedy, News 5.